What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Third Person. This is the Third Person Podcast. My name is Chris, and with me, as always, are my buddies eh. Mike and Jesse. How's it going? How's it going? What's up there? Guys, <laughs> if you didn't already know, Negan has a backstory. And we, made, we, we, we were a little late to this game. Uh, one of our wonderful subscribers let us in on this wonderful not-so-secret secret that uh <laughs> negan actually has a backstory in comic form and you can yeah. find these these uh one to three pages worth of story in the image plus monthly uh magazine that they put out uh it's put out by diamond publishing in their previews catalog and uh every month i believe since april of 2016 they've been putting out this pre this this magazine and in the back of the magazine are these particular stories these chapters of negan's uh backstory and so we thought we would just bring it to you. If you didn't know, here it is. If you did know, let's talk about it. So let's just jump right into it. W what do we got? Go ahead. Well, we find out that uh, first off, Negan is a gym teacher. And yep. <laughs> he's always been a foul mouth uh, prick. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Challenging all his students to the ping pong in, the, in his garage. And... Right. Saying he's banged their mothers in multiple positions. Yeah. Little pussies and all this stuff. And that? <laughs> yeah. He's always had that, um, you know, he's always had that kind of flair for the uh, for the verbal, uh, you know, but, the, all these funny, funny ways of demeaning people. But you know what he <laughs> yeah. says? He says to his wife, his wife's like, you know, what are you what what are you doing? Why are you cursing these kids out? What are you doing? And yeah. he's like, you're a role model to them. Why are you being like that? He's like, if I'm he goes, if I have a stick, a stick up my ass outside of school, they won't respect me. He's like, I have to be the cool teacher. So yeah. that's part of his his deal. I mean, he is a dick. Because some people can't hack it. Yeah. yeah. Like the one kid. Because yeah. the one kid said, yeah, he's a bit of a, a pussy or whatever, a bit sensitive. The one kid that he makes cry and. Yeah. And, uh, <laughs> but, you know, you know it's think, funny because yeah. I actually had a gym teacher just like him. It was gr it was great, actually. And it kind of looked like him, too. I'm not going to fucking lie with like the short that. hair crop, close crop kind of hair. And, like, um, oh, dude, what was his name? Um, Mike. Oh, God. We'll think Shavetta? about it. What? Yes. Shavetta? Yeah. Remember him? Yeah. Tol totally totally forgot you went to school with me. With, uh, I totally forgot for a second. Yeah. Remember him? <laughs> dude, it was Negan. <laughs> Yeah, he was a dick. Dude, he was absolutely yeah, he, fucking he, Negan, man. Absolutely yeah. Negan. He was a fucking asshole, but he was awesome, right? Um, yeah. Anyway, um, so, yeah, so we get some really cool backstory here because um, as his wife's yelling at him, she passes out. And I initially thought, oh, shit, this is going to be this is gonna be like she's turning into a zombie. But it turns out yeah. um, it turns out she just has cancer. You know, she's not a zombie. Oh, yeah, no, nothing big. Just, yeah, yeah. Nothing okay. big. Yeah. Um, but, yeah, so, so we find out she has cancer, and then um, – as we as the story goes on, we feel we we see that he's been cheating on his wife, and he, is it cheating though? Yeah, I mean it's cheating. She's it's cheating she's, just because his wife knows yeah. about it doesn't mean yeah. So his wife that knows she's about consenting. Um, well, not necessarily. It doesn't mean she likes it. Do we know she's not consenting? Well, she said, yeah, "Why did you?" Yeah, I mean, could be an open relationship. That's what I was saying earlier. Maybe. Like we didn't necessarily like. They didn't get into it so much, like we said, or, you know, like we said that the, it, you know it, it gives us a glimpse of it. It's not super, super in depth. So we basically find out that open to interpretation, sleeping yeah. with another woman after he finds out that Lucille, which is a pivotal his, thing, his yeah, wife Lucille, his wife's name, yeah. and we, we get that recognition of the bat and and his wife's name. And as he's, you know, got just just has this this uh, information about Lucille having cancer, he's with another woman. And during the act, he kind of says he can't do this anymore, blah, blah, blah. And the other woman, I don't think we got her name, right? No. We didn't get her name? No. But no. she kind of says, what do you want me to do? She gets pissed off, storms all out of the room. She says, get the done. fuck out. This is done. Yeah. Um, but you're trying to make me feel guilty because your wife is, has cancer. And Negan goes, you know, Negan goes to Lucille. And we get that that little dialogue between them that that uh, she says know, why says, she's like why did you do that exactly now well, she says you, now you, you the sick one she's yeah. like you wait for this to end it why yeah. I don't need it he goes I don't need it I don't I don't want it anymore I just yeah. want so you it's open it's open it's like open we don't know you know if she, how yeah. long she knew about it how long he was doing this or if she was even involved we don't you know that's what I was kind of saying like well at she, first she, I was like hmm. Again, you open term interpretation. I mean, what do you guys think? Because to me, she seems met like to me, it just seems like she knew about it. 
she but just dealt with it. she just it was like it was the thing she just they, they had probably didn't have a great marriage and they were well, together whatever look, look 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 to what what we know now in the comic negan has 10 women right you know yeah in his harem yeah so now is that a is that something where lucille was involved possibly with this other woman like the, you know, like a, or it meant that um negan wasn't going to um just stick with you know one woman after all and and he's gonna have now he branches out and everybody will know that he's sleeping with you know yeah who knows um but the point is um so i mean so moving on from that we do find out a lot so again let us know what you guys think because i i mean that's it's it's an interesting situation but but very cool how they exposed it in this in this backstory and then um so she's sick and and while she's at the hospital the the zombie apocalypse kind of happens and you know she's in there for a while you know and uh she's basically on the verge of death when this thing breaks out and his area and he's just thrown into it he's thrown into it and he ends up um getting a you know attack his wife attacks him zombie lucille attacks him and he has to like get out of there he meets up with some dude and he ends up killing two other walkers and he's like i just killed these people and this the kid in there is like my no my fucking my mom just fucking died the same way and he's like not people anymore yeah they're not people you're not a murderer and you know one thing i just thought of could could um i guess not but it would be cool. If, imagine if uh, Negan's wife and Rick were in the same hospital. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, that would be so weird, right? right? Yeah, but highly unlikely. I know. Highly unlikely, obviously. Since I, I wish we're, it was true. we're up north. You know what, now. though? Don't yeah, forget. You see Shane run past Negan or something. You know? Yeah, because they're, they're – yeah, right? They're in Virginia now. And they yeah. and Rick was in Georgia, yeah. obviously. So yeah. yeah, so I guess he's yeah. from Virginia. It's funny. Yeah, just a cool, I assume cool little thought. Negan would be. I, I assume it'd be in Virginia. Well, I believe because... in the comic, Rick was a little farther west than Georgia. Really? Why wouldn't it be in a hospital in Georgia, though? Uh, I think the show, if I remember correctly, now it's been a while since I've read issue one. Uh, that. In the show, it was for the purpose of, hey, we're in Georgia filming, so we're in Georgia. That's where King's Country is. Or oh, whatever maybe, it was. Yeah. King's, King's County. County. Yeah, King's County. Yeah. Maybe, yeah. But anyway, you know, to yeah. get back on, yeah, it, 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 would, it would have been a cool thing. But, you know, obviously, Negan, uh, getting back to the, the backstory, now Negan meets his 13-year-old kid. Negan couldn't put himself to killing Lucille because she he left her as a walker in the room yeah. and we see the the kid takes the fire extinguisher he's like can you do it i can't do it and he yeah, handles he's like i just had to do this to my mom I'm also, i'll go do yours too yeah. um yeah. and then so you know again but not not to go through it all but he ends up he ends up being out on his own the kid gets killed as they're escaping and he's like all right well fuck it you know but now you could see him starting to turn off because yeah. we saw him he was with dick with the, with this with the students then he, then he, then he, like he was all blubbery with his wife, and she's like, "Why?" And like they're sitting on a park bench at one point, and she, mm-hmm. he's he's got his hand in his hand, his head in his hands, and he's crying. And she's like, "Why are you doing this right now?" You know, like yeah. you can kind of see the relationship a little bit, where she mm-hmm. treated him like shit, kind of too, and you know, so obviously they their relationship was a little weird. It's almost anyway. like it was too late. Like she was upset. Yeah, like, she's like, "Yeah, you should have been what crying are you doing? for me. Like, why now? Before like, you found out I was sick." Yeah. yeah. So he, you know, so so. He, but in the, so in this backstory, after that hospital, you could tell he's starting to shut down a little bit. He's out on his own. He's surviving. Yeah. Uh, comes across these bunch of uh, young guys, which reminded me of Fear the Walking Dead. Actually, they look yeah. like he might be like a bunch yeah, of college kids, right? And they're like trying to, they're like they were going to rob him or something. And he was like, "Listen, guys, they wanted I, the gas. They yeah. wanted the gas." That he he's was like, "I got a car. I got this and whatever." So he's hanging out with them. Uh, cool scene. He, they're out in the fucking will, just middle of nowhere with a campfire. Very yeah. weird though. They're all just sitting there. They're all not paying attention, and they're getting surrounded by zombies. And I was like, mm-hmm. nobody – did they not realize that yet? I mean, obviously, it's early in the apocalypse. It's at but, its infancy, yeah. But I still, you wouldn't realize. think like – like like you're, you're – sur- you're, I don't know. Like, did, didn't it just seem weird to you guys? They didn't know. You know, I they guess. didn't know what draws them. You know, they don't know the sound aspect. They don't know the smell aspect. They don't know the fire and, yeah. and just, you know. Obviously, I mean, Drew wouldn't you have heard, like, uh, or something like yeah, that? Yeah, like, I mean, they were all just chilling and stuff. I guess they did too but... late. <clears throat> Negan was talking about dicks and everything, the whole freaking campfire. Oh, yeah, he's had them, had <laughs> them laugh. Everybody says Negan yeah. does. Yeah, yeah. 
I it mentioned, cool. um, is you guys uncomfortable? I'm talking about dick so much or whatever the hell he said. Yeah, I forgot yeah, exactly yeah. what. But yeah. He, yeah, so whatever. So then he just, um, they survive. Well, he survives. He's like the only survivor of that Nobody whole fucking thing. Killed. And, and he ends how up, he gets Lucille. And he ends up grabbing the bat. He used the bat to kill them to get mm-hmm. to help. Right? It was, one of the kids had the bat, actually. Yeah, yeah one of the guys had the bat. And um, at one point he was going to leave it. Right, he leaves it, and then he thinks better of it, turns around, puts it in his backpack. And then up to this point, um, that's where the comic, the backstory um, stops right now. Um, we have to wait for the next issue of Image Plus. Um, don't know. It didn't say final, right? It didn't say... It to be continued. It said, uh, yeah. There's going to be 12 issues total. There are eight currently. Okay. No, nine. This is nine. There was nine. Nine. Yeah, nine. nine. So we got three more. So we got three more. So we got three more to finish off this story. Oh, maybe how he um comes oh, to power. Maybe how he comes to power or starts the saviors. Well, we okay. See, we see how he kind of um got these kids to follow him that he yeah. met. You know, after they were gonna rob him or whatever for his gas. Or well, something, you know what? Yeah, I mean, obviously to... he's he charismatic. Charisma. Right, yeah. he's charismatic. He has he has that bravado. He's a big man. He's an imposing yeah. man. He's not, you know. Um, so yeah, wow. obviously it makes sense. It definitely makes sense. <laughs> but okay, so. On the show, but but the um, thing I like was the humanity they gave him. Actually. Yeah. Yeah. I liked it. We've been seeing that it in the current cool. comic a too. Cool little glimpse. You know. Yeah. I mean, look. Yeah. Obviously, someone. You know, most people are not sociopaths. Like they're not assholes like that. I mean, they could be Sociopath. assholes, but they care about things in their lives. Whether they, whether we care about that or not. Even assholes have things they care about, you know? Yeah. Yeah. Shitty fucking people have things that they care about, and, and, and this just happens to be it. Um, I, so I, I enjoy, I'm enjoying this. I like this. Um, I like where how, in general, I like how it came about to us because I hadn't yeah. been um, – I hadn't been – I hadn't known about this. We, we all yeah. found out, out about this at the same time. You know, yeah. and we all we all took to it real quickly and got you know got caught up. Um, but I, I I enjoy this. I enjoy I enjoy the writing of it. I enjoy, you know, I just I enjoy definitely seeing this backstory, especially for and I want to see how they're going to incorporate this stuff into the show, being yes. that we talk about the show mostly. You know, so I mean that's that's where I stand yeah. on it all. It was definitely cool though. It was yeah. definitely cool. Absolutely. I'm excited to see more. You know. Okay. Cool. I'm Anything else? Time. Anything else with this? We, any yeah. other? What are your favorite parts? Anyone got favorite parts? I mean, for me, I mean, I think the big thing is the is the bat, you know. And in the very beginning, got, he's wrapping the the well, bat in. The, yeah, you see the, the first that he's few wrapping panels. The bat yeah. with the barbed wire, so that's you know, um, you know, and the Lucille aspect of it. We did see a. I mean, overall, it wasn't huge. You know, we mentioned this, you know, together when we weren't recording that it wasn't a huge. I think it was what? How many pages? Thirty-six Not many pages. pages 30, yeah, total like thirty-six yeah. pages. Yeah. Yeah. So it wasn't, you know, we didn't dive into this huge. Um, the psyche of, of yeah. vegan, right? Yeah, yeah but, but we, we did, but we see but where we'll, he came from. Yeah, we exactly. Came... We get a glimpse, and yeah. I mean, of course, you know, we're getting that confirmation of Lucille and the and the bat. And... The fact that he was a gym teacher, we heard that he could be a gym. Yeah, teacher. Yeah, yeah, we heard that's true. Yeah, but or I think used car sales. But I think yeah, yeah, but I think now we we heard it, but it was already we probably since this had been out since April already. So <laughs> yeah, we, <laughs> we heard, heard it a little late to the yeah, party when like it came I said, to that, so... knowing this information. But Whatever, remember, man. We. Yeah. You know, we just started our channel uh, four months ago, so we yeah. weren't doing this uh, in this kind of in-depth conversation right. for YouTube for you guys. But how so. cool! But how cool that we now know that stuff, like you know, and yeah. Um, yeah. you know, and and it's cool because you know our, our community of viewers, like they all, you know, they they bring a lot of insight to this. I mean, we're just three fucking dudes that watch a lot of TV, so it's like we're kind of nerdy, <laughs> you know. But it's like we can't know everything or or yeah. be on top of everything. Hey, um, that's what the that's what the comment uh, yeah, section is. Yeah, that's there what that's for. Sec- and that's oh. what that's why we that's why you guys are so awesome. Which is why yeah. we're gonna give you guys more giveaways. So right. stay tuned for more giveaways um, on this channel. And uh, yeah, anything else, guys? Because I think we could probably just wrap this up now. Yeah, yeah I think we can wrap up. I think we're I mean, good. I think we're good. It was good. <laughs> Guys, go check it out. It's in the Image Plus uh, monthly magazine. Go check it out. Um, I'm sure you can find it one way or another. And uh, yeah, so hope you enjoyed it. Hope you enjoyed this video. This was a cool little quick video for you guys. And once again, uh, you can get to us at Third Person Pod on all social medias. We are now Third Person Pod on YouTube. So if you type in Third Person Pod, you can easily find us now. On the YouTube channel, we've got our URL. That's our new URL. 
And that's about it. Guys, thank you so much. We appreciate all your comments, all your support. And um, yeah, we just have a lot of fun doing this. So thank you very much, guys. And we will see you on the next video. Peace out.